the post on uh, drawing for the patient uh, using a tablet or a mouse made me think of this. It might be interesting to have TDRs uh, go into uh, their paint picture organizer and do a query. Um, I draw for every single patient, just like Bill said, and, uh, because it's so important in case presentation and communicating with the patient. I can't imagine uh, working and not uh, drawing for the patient. There's so many different aspects to it. So you can go in and actually query uh, and bring up all of your paint pictures. Uh, these are just mine from the last couple months of, of practice. And when you go in and you look at these, now I know most of you are very intimidated by the level of artwork here, um, but you can learn to draw like this. And uh, even if it isn't at a very high level like this, it, the quality of the picture doesn't really matter. It's the ability to explain to the patient in your own words what's happening. And the effect just simply isn't the picture. The effect uh, goes way beyond simply drawing for a picture because if you look at drawing for a patient similar to dancing with them or sharing a laugh with them or a dinner with them, when you draw for the patient, it makes a connection with the patient. It's part of the key part of actually connecting with your patient. You capture their image. You give them an architectonic vision of the case. You explain your disease model. You tell the patient, Mrs. Jones, I am drawing this just for you. And the effect of this in a practice is way beyond simply drawing for the patient. The people who don't do this are completely oblivious to its effect. So draw for your patients.